Hello friends, welcome back to Barbie Lifestyle. Today I have a fabulous story for you. Cinderella's Magical Journey. Once upon a time, in a small village, there lived a kind girl named Cinderella. She loved to help everyone with a big smile on her face. Her stepsisters were not as kind often making her do all the chores. One sunny day, Cinderella found a sparkling flower in the garden. She picked it up and felt a warm, magical glow. The flower whispered, Hold me tight and your wishes will come true. Cinderella closed her eyes and wished to see a world beyond her village. Suddenly, a soft wind swirled around her, lifting her gently into the air. She opened her eyes and found herself in a beautiful forest. The trees were tall and glittered with golden leaves. Birds sang the sweetest songs and colorful butterflies danced around her. Cinderella felt a sense of wonder as she explored this magical place. As she walked further, she met a talking squirrel named Nutty. Nutty had bright eyes and a fluffy tail, and he was very friendly. Welcome to the inherited forest, Nutty chipped. I will be your guide. Cinderella and Nutty became quick friends. They traveled together, discovering hidden waterfalls and secret meadows filled with flowers. Every step of the journey was like a dream come true. One day, they found a glowing path made of silver stones. Nutty told Cinderella that it led to the palace of wishes. If you follow this path, your biggest dreams can come true. He said, excited, Cinderella followed the path. It led her to a grand palace with shining towers. The palace doors opened by themselves, welcoming her inside. She walked in, feeling amazed by everything she saw. Inside the palace, Cinderella met a wise fairy named Glimmer. Glimmer had wings that sparkled like diamonds and a kind smile that warmed Cinderella's heart. I have been expecting you, Glimmer said softly. Glimmer showed Cinderella a special room filled with mirrors. Each mirror shows a different dream. The fairy explained. Cinderella looked into the mirror and saw wonderful things she had never imagined. In one mirror, she saw herself dancing at a royal ball, wearing a beautiful gown. In another, she was flying over the clouds on a magical carpet. Every mirror showed a different adventure waiting for her. Cinderella felt so happy and excited. Glimmer smiled and said, You can choose any dream and it will become real. But remember, the journey is what makes it special. Cinderella thought for a moment and then chose the dream of the royal ball. Glimmer waved her wand and in a flash, Cinderella was dressed in a sparkling gown with glass slippers on her feet. A golden carriage appeared at the palace gates, ready to take Cinderella to the ball. Nutty waved goodbye, wishing her good luck. Don't forget to be back before midnight, Glimmer reminded her. The carriage whisked Cinderella away to a grand castle, where the royal ball was being held. The castle was even more magnificent than she had imagined, with lights twinkling like stars in the night. As Cinderella entered the ballroom, everyone turned to admire her. She was the most beautiful girl there, and the prince could not take his eyes off her. He asked her to dance, and they twirled around the room. The music was enhancing and Cinderella felt like she was floating on air. The prince was kind and gentle and they talked and laughed 
as if they had known each other forever. It was a magical night. But as the clock struck midnight, Cinderella remembered Glimmer warnings. She quickly thanked the prince and ran out of the castle, leaving behind one of her glass slippers on the staircase. Cinderella's gown turned back into her old dress, and a golden carriage disappeared. She was back in the village, holding the sparkling flower, but her heart was full of joy for the magical night. The next day, the prince sent his servant across the land to find the girl who had left the glass slipper. They knocked on every door, looking for the one whose foot would fit perfectly into the shoe. When they reached Cinderella's house, her stepsister pushed her aside, trying to fit into the slipper, but it was too small for them. Then Cinderella shyly asked if she could try. The servant nodded, and to everyone's surprise, the slipper fit Cinderella's foot perfectly. The servant smiled and said, The prince has found his true love and invited her to the castle. Cinderella returned to the palace. Where the prince welcomed her with open arms, he was overjoyed to see her again and asked her to be his princess. Cinderella felt like all her dreams had come true, but Cinderella never forgot Glimmer's words. She knew that the journey, with all its magic and friends like Nutty, was what made her dreams so special. She lived happily even after, always cherishing the memories of her magical journey. And so Cinderella's life was filled with love, kindness and adventure, reminding everyone that dreams really can come true if you believe in the magic of the journey. Thank you for joining us on this magical adventure with Cinderella. We hope you enjoyed her journey as much as we did. Don't forget to subscribe to Barbie Lifestyle for more enchanting stories and wonderful tales. Until next time. Keep dreaming and believing in magic.